Hello, happy people. Hope you guys are doing awesome. Uh, coming at you from about negative 40 today, so hence I'm rocking some Alaskan apparel. This men's hoodie is super warm. I usually only put it on when it's like cold like this because you just never really get warm. You really don't, but check this out. It's a little chilly. No, it's cold. We've got something amazing that happened today. You guys might be seeing this out of order possibly, but this is one of the largest giveaways. I think this is the largest giveaway we've ever done in our Random Acts of Kindness. And I just want to thank you guys. You guys take the time to watch our videos. You guys support us uh, through uh, Alaskan Apparel and just, we're just blown away. And we saved for several months and I went out and bought a car. It's not a brand new car. Uh, it's a 2009 uh, with 69,000 miles on it. It's a pretty nice car. It really is. One owner, clean, and I've got the shop working on it right now. I'll probably bring you guys with me to go check it out and see if I can go put it out there for sale. Some numbers, it was, they wanted like $11,000 for this car, which is about the cheapest thing that I could find. I was going to buy something a little bit cheaper and fix it up, but I couldn't even find that. There's just a huge need here. We went and did that thanks to you guys. Again, supported by you. You guys are amazing. We go list it like really cheap, like maybe, uh, I don't know, $2,600 or something like that uh, on Facebook and just push it out there and see what happens. You know, someone comes to look at it. And again, this might be over a couple days. I'm not sure the whole logistics here uh, of, of when I can get this done, but uh, I'm just going to give it to them and it's going to be awesome and it's going to be amazing. Let's go do it. I'm super excited. Let's head into town. Okay, let's go. up to 37 below zero. This is the uh, warmest time of the day. <laughs> Question for you, have you, sorry about the noise. See, everything just doesn't work when it's 40 below. We adjust the air a little bit. Question for you guys, um, have you driven at 40 below or colder before? Is that an experience that you've had? Um, if it is not, a couple, <laughs> couple tips. Make sure your car's plugged in outside and no, it's not an electric vehicle. It's uh, heating elements to be able to have your vehicle be able to start when it's this cold otherwise it just doesn't start also when you're driving everything is everything just doesn't work so like if I go hit the brakes it's like a delay from when you hit the brakes to when it kicks in you know your ABS brakes tend to not work very well traction control sometimes will work and then everything's just kind of like <laughs> kind of beats you up so you just slow down take your time and uh, uh, but yeah it's kind of a rough ride usually Unfortunately, the vehicle is not quite done yet. They were uh, getting into uh, all the repairs and there are some things they wanted to double check. So we're gonna give it another day. We'll check in with you guys tomorrow and see if we can give a car away. All right. Yeah, we're back. As for this is more like three days because we just got back from Anchorage. So <laughs> put you on the spot like that, huh? Yeah. Harley, Glacier Garage, he's been helping me out huge. Um, because because we were gone trying to get the car picked up and you kind of looked over the service report that it looks somewhat decent is this gonna be a good car you think yeah no I mean it's good mileage 69,000 miles these guys have a great inspection yeah. here that they do on all vehicles under 80,000 miles so um, no I have a lot of faith in their team I work here okay. so I know their processes well, I'm glad you have faith I actually have more faith in him and his company because they've been able to do stuff like uh, my friend Steve he could not get his Dodge Cummins fixed anywhere I think he took it to three shops including the Dodge dealer they couldn't figure out these guys could so um, definitely this is where I take my stuff but you, you still feel pretty comfortable with what they did though yeah no for sure and anything they didn't catch because um, I mean nobody's perfect right um, want to make sure that thing's taken care of so make sure yeah he threw in a gift certificate for future work which is awesome yeah thank just you. want to make sure it's taken care of you know thank you so much harley yeah so, no problem you're amazing okay let's go give away a car okay yeah. nice 
I think that looks pretty nice. Wow. Sweet. Jeffrey, so you're the guy to talk to if someone needs to buy a car That's here. That's right. Okay, here we are. This is it. Boom. That's a mileage. That's a really low mileage. That is awesome. We listed this on Facebook and we listed this for $2,600. So I've already gotten, I think, 30 phone calls. In addition to that, I went and just like looked up. I guess these vehicles tend to be fairly reliable and they get pretty good gas mileage and they last quite a while. So hopefully this would be good for someone. Uh, the tires are a little bit on the lower side though. So I'm gonna see how it does driving there. But either way, Glacier Garage, uh, they gave us a thousand dollar gift certificate for work done over there. So huge thank you to those guys that you know if someone gets this i want this to be like a blessing and not a curse right you don't want to just go get some used car and have it be an issue even though we are giving it away gotta make sure that uh people are taking care of especially on these roads okay let's get home let's show the kids and uh i'm very excited <laughs> this is i'm super excited give you some money for a gift card Merry christmas Quick detour, sorry. Almost forgot, Alaska Fuel Services giveaway. These are the winners. Uh, we're giving away three $500 gift cards uh, for Alaska Fuel Service, so you guys can stay warm. This is only for local people. A few videos ago, and I apologize that we got behind, but these are the winners. Hopefully it'll be warmer this winter. Are we all clustered in? Yeah, clustered Snuggled in. in. Check it out, Audrey, check it out. What do you think? Nice? Yeah. <laughs> We're totally gonna surprise someone. Did it with our minivan, minivan. but nothing this nice and new. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome. Hopefully I did okay. Okay. Here we go. Ooh. What do you think? Wow. Oh my gosh, this is fancy. I know. I mean, there's like a couple little dents and yeah. stuff, but. Our van was dented quite a bit. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna get inside. All right, come drive. Oh, okay. What do you think? This is fancy. I know, it looks pretty. Like, it's pretty nice. Oh, we got stuff delivered here, too. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, this is great. Yeah, we'll take it out of the road, see what you think. It's like it is fitted for a bra. Uh, it is, yeah, for off the front. Yeah. It has auto start, has a brand new windshield, and, uh, just kind of a cute little car, I don't know. Cute little car. So I listed it for 2600 2600 I think we've got 30 or so phone calls. I bet. Hey, we started gaining daylight today. Hallelujah, praise. I get to pull down my visor. Feels good. It's two wheel drive, but it has traction control, ABS brakes, it's an auto start, new windshield. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's, uh, it felt. It, like it drove pretty straight to me. Like you got a couple little scratches. Yeah, yeah little so you, scratches. you can take your hands off the wheel. That's a good sign, right? Yeah, it keeps going straight. My car doesn't even do that. <laughs> it's nice and toasty. So how are you gonna pick somebody for this? I have no idea. I normally just say a prayer. I've been praying that that I've actually been pre-praying <laughs> that I want. I would really like to find a need. What we've noticed though is if I don't know if it's. You can call it God speaking through wives or woman's intuition or whatever. It sort of seems to work out every time you do that. And Audrey's picked up on that too. Audrey's like, yeah, that's what mom does. So we'll, uh, <laughs> you're kind of passing that on. I hope that it's okay. I mean, it's not me that's doing it. Yep. No matter what though, just randomly give it away. If nothing else, maybe this will encourage them to, you know, I don't know, want to pay forward or pay it forward or be a blessing to other people. Or if they ever have the opportunity that comes their way, they're able to do it. Because yeah. if you look for a need specifically, there's always somebody with more need. You're right. So I love doing this random stuff because right. sometimes it's just... I just hope I the know. random stuff suffices the need. I guess. There you go. But, I mean, I'm guessing they probably need a car. There is a huge need right now. You can't to, find them. You can't find cars anywhere. Yeah. They're affordable. Yeah. This is kind of extra affordable. Yeah. They just don't know it. <laughs> okay guys, so we were contemplating. I went in to go through all the text messages and I went and listened to some voicemails. I was listening to some voicemails and the first one that popped up 
was a girl and I listened to her like oh she kind of stood out to me like a little bit and then I just kept listening and go through go through and then there was one other text message that kind of stood out to me and so I was like okay babe so this is kind of what I'm thinking and then when I'm sitting there and I'm talking to him don't mind us we're up in our her office slash playroom <laughs> and when we were sitting there and I was like okay so this is who I'm thinking she calls back like right when we were talking about it yeah that was like okay that might be the one I was like, what? What are those on? What? He was calling again to inquire about it. So I think that's who we're going to go with. He's going to give her a call. So he's going to give her a call and uh, see when she's available. It's exciting. Okay. Hello? Yeah, that's me. This is Gilbert. I was just returning your call uh, on the Mazda 6 that we had listed for sale. Oh, thank you for calling me back, Gilbert. Um, oh. I was wondering if I might be able to see it sometime today. Oh yeah, absolutely. Actually, I've got it already warm sitting outside. So the pictures you saw were, yeah, the pictures that you saw we took at the dealer. We had brought into the dealer to just get some, uh, everything kind of fluffed up on it because I'm not a mechanic. So I wanted to make sure it was, you know, mechanically sound and such before we listed it for sale. Awesome. Um, so is it okay if I come sometime in the next hour or if I leave now? That would be absolutely perfect. Uh, actually, if you want, I could probably... Maybe just meet you like a gas station? Sounds great. I will just a, meet you over there. Does 2 o'clock work for you? Let me see. What time is it now? It is 1. Oh, oh yeah, perfect. Yep. So 2 o'clock, and okay. that'll be great. Thank you. Yep, thank you. All right. All right. Okay. Okay, bye. 45 minutes. Let's go. And we're off. Second shooter. I'm in the back of my car. This is so stinking fun. I will say, Bert gets, he gets like, he's super excited, but gets like super nervous because I don't know, you just don't know how people are gonna respond and you wanna make sure that you do it correctly and like, I don't know, it's like a weird feeling and like you get like this adrenaline where you're just like so stinking excited. <laughs> but this is awesome, guys, and just so you know, we could not be doing this without your guys' support. This is 100%, this is out of our YouTube fund, this is out of our Alaskan Apparel Fund. All the things that you guys support is making this happen. So, uh, we are stinking excited. Can't believe it. I hope it's a good fit. I hope it's a good fit. We're excited, and I'll try to do my best on filming. He'll try to do his best. We'll see. Um, hopefully she'll be able to go take it for a test drive if she feels comfortable. I'm um, going and test driving it, so yeah, should be a good time. Ah. Hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is her, huh? Well, this is her. I'll tell you all the bad things because that's what you're supposed to do. So okay. yeah, tires are a little bit on the lower side. They still get pretty good traction. But probably got about a year or so left out of it. And then uh, there's just a couple. The picture didn't quite show up, but there's you know a couple little dimples here and there. Um, but outside of that, I just took it to the dealer because I'm not a mechanic. Okay. And uh, they just put in struts and a new windshield. It has auto start. Oh, right. All the things. So why are you selling it? Well, I have four kids, oh. and uh, I cannot fit it. You want to go take it for a drive? I'll just sit in the back. Yeah, that'd be great. All right, let's do it. Everything was just detailed. And... It looks great. I used to have a little Mazda 3. Oh, you had a 3? Yes, and I love Okay, they just went for a test drive. It was a it was a husband and wife. It looks like young or old. Younger. Come back and they'll fight. Well, if she decides to take it, right. she's gonna decide to take it. And before we say it, we got I gotta know like, okay, are you good with this? And then well, I would wait till the money comes out. Yes, that's what it is. It'll be like to the money point where it's like, okay, yeah, you know, is this something that's gonna suit your needs? Is this gonna be good? You know, and then, um, then he'll say, well. Before we even before we even started, before we even decided to come down here, we were gonna uh, give this car to you. And he gets very flustered. He gets like, 
Because he loves doing it. He loves doing it. He is so excited. Are you from up here? Yeah, born and raised. Yeah. This is home. How about you guys? I know, we're from Massachusetts. Yeah. Oh, yeah, what brought military. you up here? Military. Military, right on. Yeah, for me, and then she works at the American Heart Association. Oh, you do? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I love it. How old are you kids? We have 15, 11, and 8, so we would have been fine, but now we have three months. So, oh boy, no. uh, you guys are packed up. Right? That changes the ball game a little bit. I appreciate you showing us on such short notice. Oh, no, well, I, I, yeah, uh, there's apparently not a lot of affordable cars out there because uh, <laughs> no. uh, there was about 40 calls. I had three just sitting there while you guys showed up. Wow. Okay, so they're test driving. That's pretty brave to be able to go when someone that you don't know is driving. Would you be okay with that? I don't know. I'd be a little nervous, I think. So they're gonna go test drive it. So we'll pop in there real quick and see how the conversation's going. Do you have the title with you? Uh, I do. No. I got all the stuff. Well, is this something that I think you, would work for you guys then? Does this fit your needs? Absolutely, yeah. Okay. 25 right now, Ken. Oh, the money. Yeah, okay. Fun. Oh, that's the fun part here. Yeah, oh. sure is. Actually, yeah. So let's, uh, let's talk about that. Yeah. Uh, it actually gets even better. So believe it or not, before you guys showed up, my wife and I already signed this title over to you guys. We are going to give this to you for free. What? What? Are you what? serious? I'm serious. We uh, we do random acts of kindness every year, and what? that's what this is going to be. Are you serious? And, uh, You're joking. I'm not joking. So and. Not only that, this is not a $2,600 car. This is an $11,000 car we just bought from the dealer simply to give it away. Are so, you serious? I am serious. And I, I, my wife, we had about 40 calls and she just, uh, like, said a prayer. Oh, nice. That's really I can't even cool. believe that. The nicest thing. Thank so you. I don't know why this is it's a God thing. This is all all in his hands type of a thing. So not only that, this is still a used car. Right. Um, Glacier Garage threw a thousand dollar gift certificate in here for oh. any future repairs. Oh my God! So you have that as well. Uh, like I said, it's gonna need some new tires. Oh. We've got a we got some money for gas. Oh. And Merry Christmas from my family to yours. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> you are very welcome. Oh Yours. Okay. Absolutely. So You're so welcome. Merry Christmas. Man, thank you so thank much. You so You're so welcome. Hope it's a blessing to you guys. Holy crap. So that that's unreal. I couldn't even like, I never even heard that. That's unreal. So we, we do random acts of kindness every year and this is the big one and we're just waiting for the right the right person, the right couple. Well so. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Our, I can't even really believe yeah. it. <laughs> well, this is your car, and, and if oh you guys God. end up getting in an issue or you need some money, just feel free to sell it. It's free and clear, all yours. Thank you thank so, so much. much. You're so welcome. Thank you so much. I Merry can't thank Christmas. you enough. I, I did you video a little bit. Are you okay if I share a little bit on social media? I didn't show your faces. Absolutely. Yeah, thank you so awesome. much. Awesome. Oh, you're the that's best. Just, thank I, you so much. That's amazing. Wow. God bless you guys. So no, so this is actually paid for. My wife and I have a YouTube channel, and all of our money that we make, we save for several months to try to do this. So this is all paid for from people that watch our YouTube channel. Believe it or not. That's incredible. So, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Merry Christmas. You guys are awesome. A face. Look at that face. You can assess. They're still trying to process. Oh, they're just taking pictures. They're blown away. <laughs> was it awesome? It was awesome. Yeah? It was absolutely awesome. That was so cool. Okay. <laughs> that was awesome. What'd you think? What'd you You did a good job, babe. I, I did a good job. So, I didn't so, do anything. So that was a that was a military couple. Okay. And she's not comfortable driving here, and they've been trying to find an affordable car. They couldn't find one. They had this old focus they had. So they were really just trying to trying to figure stuff out and couldn't find anything. And then uh, like he was just ready to hey, do you have the title? Let's let, let's go right now. And I told him, told him how much it was, and I told him that you had prayed, and it was like you, for some reason, thought that she needed to have a car, and uh, it's a God thing, it's not us, and anyway, it was, yeah, they were cute. He's blown away, Yeah. giving me hugs, she's she's in tears, like, can't Aww. believe this actually happened, <clears throat> and this doesn't happen without you guys, you guys That's are what I awesome. told him. Imagine if we could do this more, like, this is the largest random act of kindness we have ever done, and it felt amazing. Okay. Did you get like? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Between, I told you he always does. Between the adoption stuff I know. 
And then this, I'm about emotionally drained. But at least we're going into Christmas, so there's no, you know, that's just chill, right? It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Glad it worked out, because there for a minute there, it wasn't necessarily gonna, there was some speed bumps. We oh, weren't yeah. quite getting stuff done in the time that we needed to get it done by. We know we were getting ready to leave for the adoption. It just, and it all worked out. It was amazing. It was awesome. Awesome, awesome. Woo! Yay! All right, guys. That's so cool. You are awesome. Yes. And we will see you guys. We'll see you on Christmas Eve. All right, they'll probably see us after Christmas Eve. Though. You'll see us after Christmas Eve, but the next video you see will be our Christmas Eve. There we go. We'll see you Christmas Eve. Hi, this is Nikita, Prashant, and Arya from Arizona. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. See, see you, you in the, the next, next video. video. Bye. Bye. YouTube, YouTube channel. channel.